So hello guys, this is Mephistopheles here and uh, I have no time for the intro, yes I have time for the intro, but something wrong with my webcam and I have to um, to turn off my computer, but now I don't want to, so I'll make a quick intro with uh, a dance bars picture. Um, here's a battle with uh, a good friend of mine, a Giga Freezer, uh, and it, that is that was we were both testing our new Pokemon. He was tos testing his Kanto team, and it was a very awesome battle. <coughs> and uh, it was a very close battle, very epic match. You'll see in the future in the video. And uh, please, I leave a link in the description to his channel. Check him out because he's an awesome guy and. Uh, he explained to me how to make HD videos and stuff so he made awesome he makes awesome things and etc uh, and uh, okay what else to say uh, expect the St. Valentine's Day video cause it's today St. Valentine's Day so I'll make a special cool St. Valentine's Day so okay see you in the video bye yeah, as I said, here is a battle with uh, Giga Freezer, and we were both testing our new Pokemon. He leads off with a uh, Venusaur, and I lead off with my nice wife, but it's actually it's male, so it's like lol. Uh, my nice wife is uh, Scarfed, so I want to go for Psychic to get as much damage as I can, and I actually surprised how lot it did. <coughs> And he sets up the Sunny Day, which is not good for me, I guess. And I go for another Psychic. And that will kill his uh, Venusaur, which makes me really happy. But the sunlight is up, and so I don't know what to expect. And he goes into shiny Charizard, and he's like laughing at me, because I'm not a nice wife, I'm like nice husband. Um, the psychic did a lot, but uh, it, um, but he, the Charizard is able to set up the... Um, the substitute and uh, he gets the Pattaya Berry and now I'm really afraid of this thing so I need to get rid of the sub and now he goes into Solar Beam and I actually was surprised how I lived the Solar Beam man but I really I have uh, special some special defense uh, EVs so now I'm able to finish it off so it's a pretty good start my nice wife killed already two Pokemon and now sh he goes into Starmie and I have to switch and I switch it to my Credili and he predicts it pretty nicely and goes for Ice Beam because I was predicting a Surf but anyway it's a 3 hit KO so it's pretty awesome for me but now he goes for Surf for some random reason I think he was predicting a switch so it I set up the toxic cuz the life orb and the toxic I want to weather it down uh, so it won't be so scary as as it could be so now I have to switch with my Credili cuz I don't want to risk him to over predict or stuff uh, and uh, sorry about this black screen and he goes, he doesn't over predict something, he goes for Ice Beam to kill my, um, my, uh, okay, he kills my Espeon, but not a great of a deal. I go into my Glalie, because I don't have anything else. He goes for Thunderbolt and gets a Barahax. I was so pissed off, man, that was so stupid. But I play switch and, uh, I play safe, I play safe and go for, um, Shadow Ball. Uh, so I kill off his Starmie, which makes me really happy. Now he goes into Zeus, uh, he is Zabdos. And looking at my team, I see that I'm going to be raped by this Zabdos. He goes for the Heat Wave, kills off my Glalie, but I wanted to explode this turn. Now I go into my Oma Star, hoping that I can live one Thunderbolt and successfully get a nice beam off. But actually, Omastar is defensive bulky, not special bulky, so my Omastar goes down. And now I go into my Leech Seed, which is actually a sub puncher. He goes for the Heat Wave. And watch, watch, watch. Oh god, I live with 1 HP without Focus Sash. That's so. Man, that's so crazy. That was. Oh. I thought I'm gonna lose at this point. Uh, but maybe I lose, maybe I'll not. So I successfully put it asleep, and now I go for Stone Edge as he slips, and uh, the Stone Edge is a 2 hit KO, so it's a barely survive vision. I can't believe I uh, lived with um, one hit point. And now because of my Poison Heal, I get quite a lot of HP, I think. 
and I kill it off with another stone edge. I get go to get a useless crit. Now I have HP that I can set up as as a substitute. Oh man, what's this black screen? So uh, he goes into his clefable. I put it asleep. Then now I set up my substitute. So I w w would be safe now uh, behind the substitute. And now I will go for the focus punch because I'm pretty sure I can kill even if it's uh, ma max uh, max uh, defense or stuff. And he wakes up and goes for seismic toss, which obviously breaks my sub. And I go for the focus punch to successfully kill it off. And that was pretty awesome. And I kill off his clefable. And um, he has now only only blast always left so now I'll put it to sleep then set up a sub then two focus punches and I will kill it off so that was a very epic match Giga Freezer that's so epic as crap I survived with one hit point that was so super and I really liked this game this battle maybe I hope we can have another match uh, soon so rate comment subscribe guys and uh, bye. Yeah. Focus punch. Focus punch to hit KO. And, and really cool. Breloom is really cool as crap. So, okay. Uh, another time, good game. Oh, he went for hidden power as he wakes up. But not a great of a deal because I have my substitute. So, yeah. Good game. The third time. <laughs> I said it, so rate, comment, subscribe, and see you all next time.